Hi learners, welcome to my channel Data Science University with Mbalvi Prasad. The agenda for today's video is Project 2, Pandas Read Code, Question Type Easy, 1565, Unique Orders and Customers Per Month. The GitHub link for the solution is provided in the description below. You can join my Telegram community for further updates. The link is available in the description below. Now, let's solve together the problem. Okay, they have given a orders table, okay, which is consisting of some order ID, order date, customer ID, invoice, okay. Now what they are saying, write a solution to find the number of unique orders and the number of unique customers with invoice greater than 20. So, from this table, they want to filter for invoice greater than 20 and for each different month, you can see here. 2029 for example 2009 15 2029 17 both are combined under one single thing so they want to consider for these two things 2029 15 2097 as one thing how many things are there such that invoice is greater than 20 and number of unique order id and number of unique customer id okay it's very simple first of all let us extract only this one okay so i will write like this orders order date is equal to orders order date so let me convert into that means i think it's in the date format yeah let me convert into string so that i can slice it string dot str let me slice for the first seven things. Return orders. So now we can see, right? This table has been modified in the form of year and month only. Now, what I need to do for each order date, order dot group by. So directly, let me call it as month only. So that there will be no issue. Group by the month column group by month column and calculate order date order count I want to create a new column called order count something count and how it should be created it should be created on top of order ID and how it should be created by taking the unique values the count of unique values similarly one more column I need to create customer count customer ID unique okay okay now I want the month column also so let me reset with X okay Okay, we should first filter for invoice also, right? So, filter the orders table such that orders of orders invoice is greater than strictly, yes, strictly greater than 20. Okay, let me check for all the test cases that's it we have successfully solved this problem if you want the code output for this it will be available in this github repository where the category the question number the lead code URL link the YouTube URL link and the github URL link will be available in the the repository URL will be available in the video description if you are interested in learning in-depth 
analytics ml nlp cbr generative ai stuff please fill in this google form in the description below if you are preparing for data science interviews please check out my playlist it will be greatly helping your interview process if you have any other further questions regarding the problem which has solved use this hashtag in the comment section and i will try to clear your doubts as soon as possible okay until then keep learning your own